None of Jim Perry's show pigeons are leaving their enclosure these days to protect them from avian flu. The illness can be spread by wild birds and prove deadly to domestic birds like chickens and turkeys. What I've done is just made sure of hygiene measures, clean uh, loft management. Uh, I haven't let them out to fly, so uh, they don't come in contact with birds of prey. The president of the Vernon Pigeon and Poultry Club is recommending his members take similar precautions. It could be a matter of 10, 15, 20 years, might be a lifetime, that these breeders have been working on a particular breed. Avian flu will take that whole thing away just uh, in seconds. So it it's, can be very devastating. The concern comes after highly pathogenic avian influenza was detected in two more BC flocks this week, including a small backyard poultry flock in Kelowna. Bringing the total number of BC properties infected to three and underlining that avian flu is not just a risk for commercial producers. This is pretty serious and, and if, they, uh, if they get exposed to this, um, uh, you know, from what we've been seeing, it's, it's a very low survival rate, if, if at all. For those with backyard chickens, protecting your flock also helps protect local commercial operations. Because it's an environmental contamination is the way that the main spread is, you carry it into your flock house or your birds can be exposed to it outside. And the safest thing you can do right now would be to put them indoors and it would be, it would be for their birds' health. At this pet store that serves customers with backyard chickens, the owner says most are well aware of the avian flu risk. A lot of the, the reactions and the conversations have been quite uh, nervous ones. People are wondering how they're going to quarantine their birds. Some of our customers have been using chicken mesh and putting it over top of their ponds or over top of their large uh, outdoor aviaries. From small flocks to large-scale farms, those who keep birds are all hoping their efforts will be enough to help the outbreak pass quickly. Megan Turcato, Global News.